from Agnostic Front. I'm gonna miss this place when it's gone. How you doing there? I got a new album coming out. You gotta come out and check it out, all oh, y'all. What up, everybody over here? These are my friends. We're gonna enjoy the show tonight. All right. When's the album coming out, Vinny? Uh, October, November. I don't know. When's it coming out? You know. I just joined the bagpiper game. I don't know nothing. Is it on uh, Stillborn? Uh, I don't know. I, but Jamie is my manager, so whatever. What's your favorite CB's memory? Oh, I don't know. Maybe putting the nail in the wall. I don't know. I have so many, I can't think of it right now. So we're here at Dropkicks. You're going to be part of the bagpipes Oh, yeah. I'm playing tonight. bagpipes tonight. My first debut playing bagpipes. Let's see what you're wearing. All right. And there you go, girl. <laughs> Thank you, Vinny. All right, sweetie. Oh, okay. okay, now. There we go. I got to take it again. I got to get into What's up, Mike from Agnostic Front? I play bass, and um, this is pretty much the last month here at CBGB's, and um, unfortunately it's closing. And um, people behind me being assholes. Hey, they work here, it's okay. Yeah, so, so they're um, I think I have so many memories here that it's just, I mean, I've been here at least a thousand times, like literally. But, um, How old were you when you started coming here? Uh, I don't know. I don't remember. <laughs> I don't remember anything. If you know me, you know I don't remember anything. Nah, I'm probably like 17, you know? But um, one memory that always sticks in my head is when I was so drunk and bombed here, and the crow mags were playing, and I was so drunk and I was singing the wrong lyrics, so, and everyone was looking at me like I was crazy, but I am crazy, so. I don't know. That's just the only one I can stick in my head right did, now. Did you jump on stage with of John? Course, of course, and he was looking at me like I had 10 heads. Like, what the hell is this guy saying? But that was one memory. There's so many other ones that I just can't even remember right now, but that was... That's a good CB's memory. That's a good memory, yeah. Thank you, baby. We're going to see more from Agnostic Front in 2007? Of course. New record coming out. When does the new album come out? Uh, we're writing record right now, so we have no idea. But we have live at CBGB's DVD. It's in stores right now, so check it out. Live Great. at CB's. That's the problem. Thank you, baby. Hey, Mix. Mix. Roger. How are you? How was the wedding? The wedding? Yeah. Jesus Christ, you're going to put me all out there. <laughs> the wedding was fantastic, it really was. By the way, I'm, expect I'm having a baby soon. Oh my God! Yeah. <laughs> Emily's pregnant? She's pregnant. Again? Emily and Daddy, June 5th is a due date. So we got married a month later, she got pregnant. One of those things. Oh, congratulations. Two months later, yeah. We got married in August and October we finished it. So last year you had the tour schedule from hell. Like AF was seven months, then it was disasters. I don't even think you were home last year. So I wasn't. I wasn't. Are you going to be able to take some time off this year and be a dad? Well, I've been doing that. Doing that. You no, but you know, I, I like the road. I like playing my music. You signed to a new label recently, didn't you? For Sarah's Grave. And I do plan on um, hitting the road. And we plan to do some disaster stage tonight. Last time I played here was with John Jett. Right, how was that? It was great, you know. She wound up doing one of the CB shows. She was playing a couple of dates. She's been back. And we played here together. She wanted us to do a, a, like 10 or 12 shows with, with her, but I was just like, I need a crazy you know? So how are you liking uh, Southwest? I like it. Yeah, warm temperatures, good. Yeah, but you know, this is really nice too. Yeah. And what's the next album? Are we due for another disaster? We're doing, no, we're doing an agnostic for now. Okay. Disaster just came out my riot. You got it? Or no, you gotta get me a copy. We'll play that in the store. It's my, it's my favorite record. It just came out. On and Sailor's Grave. That's Sailor's Grave, not Hellcat. Okay. Right, and then uh, the new Agnostic Front on huh? Nuclear Blast again. You doing well with them? Yeah. Good. Good. So, I just took a break, you know. I got married. Now I'm expecting a child. And, uh, we're doing like 10 dates with AF in January. Then we're going to Japan, Australia, New Zealand in April. Good. Good. Then I'm gonna have my baby. <laughs> You know? And then when, um, then you're going to take some time off after that? Just a few, and I, I'm thinking once the new AF album comes out, come like fall next year, I'm out with AF. I'm but I do want to do some disaster things. In between? Yeah. Good. I've been doing um, a couple of interviews back and forth for American Hardcore, the movie, and okay. I saw Jimmy and Vinny in that, and I know they had some footage of you on stage. Did you get to see that movie? Not yet. Not yet? What was the one that you were in on IFC? Oh, that was with uh, Punk Attitude. 
That was good. I did an interview with uh, Don Letts, who's Don Letts is you know he he, he was documenting the crash back in you know the seventies. I was kind of honored to be part of it. He called me, he wanted me part of it, so I was good. I never saw, I never saw the yeah. Don Letts thing. I never saw the American Hardcore thing. Don but Letts I will. was great. American Hardcore is interesting. You guys just made the cutoff because they wound up doing a date on it where any we band always just made after the that, Cigarette Hall wasn't in it. Well, they, you know, we. But, uh, I don't know why we it. made a cutoff. We've been there since '81. But well, awesome, my dear. Congratulations on being um, a soon-to-be new dad. That's Thank wonderful. You. And um, I can't wait to hear the new AFL. See, oh, wait a minute. Inadvertently. Dedication. And then I found wow, out that that really was a uh, cartoon. That's awesome. That I know. really good. I got it for the Buddhist purpose, and then I was like, Mikey saw my hands, and he's like. You got another AF track on your hands, yeah, and I'm dedication. like, okay, we'll call it that. You know, we don't do that song. We do, we still do. Um, you doing so pure to me? Uh, doing so pure to me tonight. You gonna do that for me? Thank you, baby. Signing off. <laughs>
for six fucking years. You fucking stolen. <laughs> Honestly, man, it's been the greatest life I've ever had. I would never dream of anything different.